Hello Scorpios, I know it's been a while since I've been on YouTube. I have gotten several requests to bring back your free weekly tarot sketch, so I'm going to do just that. Uh, before I get start started, I've had some of you message me regarding the Reiki course, and it does look like this. If you guys will go back to my channel, there is an actual individual video posted on um, just learning Reiki from home. So if you have any questions, please message me on my website. It is www.ms-swami.com. And you will find a link to my website on the information box below this video. So right now, I want to take a broad, generalized view. Um, this is for Scorpios for the week of May 30th. Oh, happy Memorial Day, guys. And don't forget to remember what this day is really about. So let's get started on a broad general view for Scorpio for the week of May 30th. Scorpio, we're starting with the Eight of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune, the Eight of Swords, the Ace of Cups. And the King of Cups. So, from what I'm looking at here, Scorpios, you got a lot going on this week. Okay, um, you do have some new beginnings here, and the Wheel of Fortune shows that it may not be as quickly moving as what you what you may think it should. It also indicates to me that you may think that things can go either direction, either good or bad. It actually shows me you've got the Victory card here. And with the King of Cups, it does show me that you're, you're ending the week on a good note and that you're kind of where you need to be. The only thing I find concerning are your Ace of Swords, okay? This is self-imposed restrictions. So sometimes you have to let go of a situation or a matter or the way you're thinking in order, to <coughs> excuse me, in order for things to move forward in your life. Now I have another go-to deck that I will take a look at for Scorpios for the week of May 30th. See so if we can go a little further with this. There is some type of celebration going on. Um, do be warned of your, your scattered energy going back to your self-imposed restrictions. It does look like that you guys are hoping for some news on money, career, something like that. It may not come in this week, but next week looks more significant for that. Do move forward with your goals. And, you know, if end of the week is time for some good meditation and just to count your blessings, it's not a bad week for Scorpios at all. Now, what I want to do is I want to do a couple cards just to give you a generalized look. Like I said, this may or may not resonate with you. For Scorpios for the entire month of June. Scorpios, we start with the moon, the chariot, and the seven of wands. Just like starting the first week of May 30th, moving forward, you've got a lot going on in the month of June, okay? You've got a lot of good coming to you in the month of June. You have a lot of your goals being reached, but it's taking some hard work to get there. And there may be some setbacks along the way, okay? And it may be an individual that is holding you back from reaching your goals. Uh, it could be, like I said, I've seen a lot of self-imposed restrictions. So it could be you that's holding yourself back. So just remember that. You've got a great month of June of coming. Uh, please visit my website later this evening, early tomorrow. Your free monthly horoscopes will post for the month of June. And as always, please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.